noticed that we're doing our live video at 12 o'clock and that's because we got some feedback from some of our viewers and they thought that it would be easier for them to watch in the middle of the day so we're hoping that you're on your lunch break right now and you're tuning in and this particular topic is one that we get asked about by buyers but also we've had real estate agents who have reached out to us and they they're asking you know why do you guys focus on new construction so much so if you're not familiar with us uh the the bulk of our business is new construction we've represented over a hundred buyers who have built new construction so it's about 80 percent of our transactions are oh, with sure. new construction so having said that so we wanted to answer your questions and talk about the benefits of buying new construction and i know in this market as well as probably most markets right now there's so much building going on right. so as a buyer you have that choice do i buy a resale or do i buy new construction so i think it's a great topic i'm glad we're talking about it today and the first benefit i think one of the most important is when you go into a new community you have that on-site sales associate that works for the builder right there in the community at your disposal yeah and they're the expert so let's speak to that for a second, because I think there's a, there's some myths. We need to do some myth busting. Okay, today, let's really. start with the myth busters. So, but uh, let's start with the sales associate. It's not an adversarial relationship. They embrace realtors because between seventy and eighty percent, on average, uh, of their deals coming through the door are coming through with realtors. Right. So they they're really realtor centric, um, but I want to point out a few things. Um, as our ally, as our friend, as our partner in this thing, they're the community experts. So they know everything about the community, everything about the amenities, everything about the fees, everything about the product, the housing product in there. Mm -hmm. But really what I want to stress is you guys have to realize that they've gone through rigorous sales training that we don't have access to. So they know all the right questions to ask, to pull out. Is this in the best interest of the client? So they're working in the best interest of the client and quite frankly working in the best interest of us. The other myth buster is a client going in or a buyer going in thinks that they can get a better deal without a realtor or without representation. Right. Now, the builders have got to figure it out. If 70, and 80, 70 to 80 percent of the business is coming in from the real estate community, that is actually part of their marketing budget. It's yep. a significant, it's actually the majority of their marketing budget. Cobroke, incentives for realtors. But that is the marketing budget, how to attain the business. It has nothing to do with the dealings on the negotiation. Right. So, so as a buyer, if I walk in with a real estate agent or without a real estate agent, I'm going to pay the exact same price for that house. Because like you said, that, yeah. that commission that the realtor is making is built into the builder's corporate marketing budget. It has nothing to do with that individual community, that individual sale. So you're going to pay the same price whether you have a real estate agent or not. So why not have the representation, right. have the help by your side? But as you said, it's a partnership. So the buyer, the real estate agent, and the on-site rep, we're all going to work together as one cohesive group to get the buyer to the finish line. And realtors just realize that is the truth. We're dealing with it all the time. We have good relationships with our on-site reps. They are professionals and they're trained. Another thing I want to point out, which might be part of your marketing plan in the future as a realtor, guess what? If somebody comes in unrepresented into there and they have a home to sell, they have to give it to a realtor somewhere. Uh, yeah. And if you have a relationship, they might give it to you. Exactly. So there's lots of benefits. Yes. <laughs> it's an all around win-win. Yeah. So don't forget that real, the associate working in the community is the expert and they yep. are there they do have your best interest in mind as a buyer so partner with them work with them and you'll get the best deal possible now the second benefit of buying new construction probably the easiest one that everyone thinks about is that everything is new it's shiny it's new it's beautiful but it's not all about the shiny new kitchen and the upgraded features inside the home it's not, it's not. there's oh. more there's more t t than just that when you buy a new home, don't forget you're getting a brand new roof, a brand new AC, a brand new water heater, the windows, the plumbing, everything is brand new. So what does that mean to you as a buyer? Well, when I move into this house, I don't have any home repairs for five years, 10 years, 15 years down the road, where if I buy a resale home, 
I know in the next couple of years I might have to you know repair the hot water heater I might have an issue with the AC I might have something with the roof with new construction you don't have to worry about that so that's peace of mind when you're buying that you're going to move in and be worry free because you don't have any repairs to worry about and you get sparkly and new and you get the sparkly and new <laughs> with a new home so outside of the, the the structure the roof all of that being brand new you also have the energy efficient features mm -hmm. You're not going to get that in most resales. So I'm talking about the energy efficient windows. Most builders now are doing the low E windows. Uh, most of them have the upgraded insulation, yeah. uh, the appliances, everything is more energy efficient. So what does that mean to you as a buyer? That means that your electric bill is going to be lower. So every single month. We can quantify that too, because yeah. really at 2,500 square feet or so, you are literally cutting your power bill in half. In half. From the boom, from the boom times. You built in 03 to 06. Right. So what that means is every single month you have savings in your pocket on a monthly basis that you wouldn't be getting in a resale. Now mm -hmm. that adds up short term and long term. Now, other than you know the house being new the energy efficient features something that people don't really realize is that when you buy a new home the floor plans are more convenient to your right. lifestyle and the the reason this is is because builders invest tons of money into researching and studying what today's buyer wants in a home and that equates to a better floor plan so you know a few years ago 10 years ago or so or longer uh, a buyer may have found it import, important to have that separate formal dining space. Right. That's not the case today. Most buyers find that that space is just wasted space. Your family isn't going to go to a separate room in the house to have dinner. What buyers are looking for is that open concept where the living room, the kitchen, the dining room is all together and you can interact as a family. It's all usable. It's all usable space right. and that's what you're going to get with new construction because that's how the builders are building today. Yep. And what they're also doing is they're following the building codes of today, which are far superior to what they were even five, 10 years ago. So you know that you're going to have a safer home and a better built home when you buy new construction. Yeah. Now, the other benefit, the part we really like, but buyers like as well, is the easy process. Yeah, and let's speak to that. I mean, it's an easy sales process because you have a model center, and so we've just talked about it. The uh, the design, the layout is going to be today's taste. You're going to have the new kitchen cap. You are going to have the sparkly stuff. You are going to get the sparkly you know. stuff. <laughs> um, so it, that part of the sales process really works because it is new. You got higher ceilings, so visually it's way more appealing. Secondly, would be the builders have their affiliates, title companies, and mortgage companies. That's another myth buster right now that we need to hit. It's not about the builder making money, it's about customer service. Think about this, if 80% of the reasons, the reason that things don't close on time is mortgage, you wanna get control over that customer service. So it is about getting it to the end, it's a business, and it needs to close on time, that's costing the builder a lot of money if it's not closing on time, and you don't have a happy client. So that's the other piece. From a realtor's point of view, you do not have contract to close. You don't have to go right. through an inspection process on an old home. And inevitably, you're going back to the table and renegotiating items at that time. So you're almost starting from scratch on, on, with older homes. Yeah. We them. don't have to deal with that. We don't have to deal with uh, meeting appraisers. We don't have to deal with any of that stuff. Fix-ups, all of it. It's it's a smooth process. Really, in essence, I think the number is somewhere between 40 and 50 hours per transaction you're saving. Right. So sell new, you're going to be able to sell a whole lot more units and make more money as well as it being a, a better experience for your client. Right. And when you buy new construction, remember, you don't have an emotional seller like you would have with a resale. Just That's like, true. Just like you, Yeah, just like you said, when you go through inspection, stuff comes up, then you have to go back to the table and it's almost like you're renegotiating the deal all over again on a resale because, you know, the inspector finds issues. Now you've got to incorporate that into the price. It's a messy transaction, it's stressful, and it's time for the real estate agent, but it's also time for the buyer. You're communicating with them, trying to renegotiate. So with a new construction, the process is just so much easier for the buyer yeah. and for the real estate agent. Now, another huge benefit of buying new construction is your home warranty. So when you buy new construction, you're actually gonna get a home warranty from the builder. 
Now there's two parts to that that I want to touch on. So the builder is going to give you a structural warranty, yeah. which is anywhere usually about 10 years, but a couple builders even offer a 15 year structural warranty. You're not going to get that with a resale. But the other side to the builder home warranty is that first year, which I think is the most important. So when you buy a brand new home, you get your warranty, you move into the home. The builder is going to touch base with you somewhere around maybe the 30 day mark, 60 day mark. Once you're living in that brand new home, they're gonna to touch base with you and they're gonna ask you, you know, now that you're living in the home, have you found anything, you know, anything needing touch up or repair? And if you do by chance, if they missed something, you're going to get that repaired. But the best part is that once you're living in that home that first year, the builder usually comes back to you around the 10th or 11th month. And they ask you to go through the home again with a fine tooth comb, make a list of any little you know, you know, touch ups you might find something that needs to be looked at or repaired. And the builder will actually come in at the end of your first year, do all those little repairs and updates or whatever may need to be touched up. So after your first year, it's like you get a brand new house all over again. That's how confident the builder is in the design, in the structure. They know that you're getting an amazing home and they want you to be happy. That's why they offer this. Are you gonna get something like that on a resale? No, a seller's not gonna do that. No, a seller of a resale is not gonna check in with you after your first year to make sure you're still happy with the home. So the home warranty is huge and with the home warranty we have found and studies show that when you buy a new home that has a builder warranty and the time comes when you're ready to sell maybe seven ten years 20 years down the road knowing that that home had a builder warranty typically when you sell it you can get up to three percent more on your purchase price that's another benefit in itself yeah depreciation yeah so exactly so now that we're talking about appreciation and value why don't you speak to that when it comes to a new home? Yeah, statistically, um, in the first five years in particular, the new home will appreciate a lot faster than a resale. And we've talked about, we've touched on most of those things. So the, the energy efficiency, the new building codes, the design, those are the main reasons. But also, you're usually within a, a new community. And inside that new community, you've got uh, amenities and everything else. As the community is getting built out, that demand is is pushing the prices up too a little quicker than an older community. Right. So all in all, you're definitely appreciating a lot faster on, this, on the front side. Right. And the difference is when you buy a resale, is typically not the case because every year you're living in that resale, the roof, the AC, those are getting older, whereas you still have warranties with the new home. Right. And speaking of warranties, we didn't mention the appliances. I want to touch on that. So yeah, when you buy a new home, remember all the appliances are brand new. So in addition to the builder warranty, you actually, you also get the manufacturer's warranty from those appliances and the AC. In a lot of cases, you get the AC warranty of up to 10 years. Right. And then you also get the appliance the, each of the appliance has its own warranty from the manufacturer. So that's just more peace of mind knowing that you're making a great investment, you're moving in, you don't have any worries when you buy new construction. So we've gone over a lot of benefits for buying new construction. And as we mentioned in the beginning, the bulk of our business is new construction. So, you know, we kind of consider ourselves experts when it comes to it. And so well, we are experts. Oh, okay. Yeah. You heard it. We're good teammates. Yes. So we, we work with the on-site reps. We have relationships with all of them. We know, you know, if we have a buyer that comes to us and says, this is my budget, this is what I'm looking for, we can narrow it down for them and tell them exactly what new communities would work best for them. Right. Now, a couple of things that we want everyone to walk away with today. So there's three main points that if you get anything out of this video, these are the three main points that this we want. This is your close? This is my it's close. Big. This is it, get ready. So the first one, the on-site sales associate is your partner. Yes. They're your friend. They are the expert, and they're going to ensure that you get the best deal possible, the best house that fits for you. So be open to them. Be ready to work with them. It's going to be a smooth transaction if you're open-minded and you're ready to work with the on-site. Yeah, and you can come in with, um, you know, the areas information they mm -hmm. can they can hone in on the community so you're still a team mm -hmm. it doesn't mean you don't you're coming in with no information and you're not being a partner but yeah rely on be a teammate to the on-site rep 
Yep, so that's the first one. The second key point, you will save money if you buy new construction. You will save money because in your first five to 10 years, you don't have repair costs. You're not replacing a roof. You're not replacing appliances. You're not worrying about the AC. That's money in your pocket and that's big money in your pocket, but also, Power bill. The power bill. Insurance. Yeah. So your insurance is going to be significantly cheaper and your power bill is going to be significantly lower depending on how big your house is. Right. So that's money in your pocket yeah. every, every month, month that you're saving. If you're worried about your monthly payment, add in those factors. Exactly. So your electric bill might be $100, $150 cheaper every single month. You could put that money into a bigger, nicer home. That could be part of your mortgage payment instead of having to pay it to electric every single month. A hundred bucks is 20,000 on your loan. Exactly. Yeah. The third key point that we want you to take away from is this. Is this the last one? Is this is the finale? <laughs> this is the finale. <laughs> is that when you buy new construction, it will be the easiest home buying experience you've ever had, guaranteed. And studies show that people who buy new construction only ever buy new construction for the yeah. rest of their life. They'll yeah. never buy a resale again because they see the value in the new construction. They see the warranties. They see how easy the process is and how little headaches they had that you would have had to deal with with a resale. They like shiny and new. And they like shiny and new. <laughs> That's part of it. So these are the three main points that we wanted to hone in on, make sure you walk away with. But if you are considering buying a house, resale or new, and you're still not really sure, please reach out to us. We'd love to sit down with you further, go into a little more detail. We can do a side-by-side -side comparison of a resale to new construction, or if you just, you're ready to buy a house and you don't even know where to start, we can help you. Like I mentioned, we'll sit down, look at your budget, the location you're looking for, what amenities are important to you. Most importantly, your non-negotiables. Yeah. What yeah. What's non-negotiable? What the woman wants? What the wife mm -hmm. wants? The wife's <laughs> going to make the decision. Sorry, guys. <laughs> and we'll help you through this transaction. We guarantee it, it's going to be the easiest process you've ever had with new construction. And if you know someone who's considering buying here soon, share this video with them, tag them. If they're not considering new construction, get this video in front of them right away. They have to see this. And we would love to answer your questions further. So reach out to us, give us a call, give us a comment below if you have questions and we'd love to take you out and show you some new homes. Absolutely. So give us a call and stay tuned. We're gonna keep doing these videos on a weekly basis and we're gonna do them at noon now. So hopefully you're catching us on your lunch break. Anything else? No, I think All that's right. it. You got it. All right. Well, thank you guys for joining and we'll see you guys next week.